Hi, my name is Rebecca, and today we're going. To, I'm going to do an exercise. It's called officially, I think, something like hip extension, but I call it glute squeezes because that's what you're doing. You're squeezing your glutes, so and that's why I really like it. It's one that is um, you can do it many different ways, and today I'm going to show you um, with both legs, like both legs down, and then one leg at a time. So all you all you have to do is you just have to have a floor and your body and you just lay back and you bend your knees so that they're just comfortable and your heels are on the ground and you're going to be um, laying with your head and shoulders on the ground too and you want your feet to be right underneath your knees approximately so that when you come so you're going to be laying here and then you're just going to do a glute squeeze and so you're just going to squeeze your glutes up and down just like that down just like that okay so you're just going to squeeze up and squeeze you know try to really Focus on squeezing your glutes as hard as you can. And you're not going to go super fast like one, two. Oh, that actually hurt. <laughs> we'll go, go slow. Squeeze down. Squeeze. And you're not going to actually hit ground like I'm doing right now. You kind of just touch and go back up. You know what I mean? So you're going one, two, three, four, five, six. And really squeeze seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm going to do... What I like to do is about 25 to 30 to really get, because um, we're, you know, we're using our own body's resistance, but we don't have any added weight to it. And so just really squeeze. I start filling my hamstrings, my glutes, my hamstrings, and even keep your tight, your core pulled in tight. Make sure you're breathing well, though. And I think I have about, you know, just a few more, and that would be about 25. And then I would do three sets of 25 to 30. And the other variation I'm going to show you, like let's say you've done that for a while and you're like, oh, I'm, I'm good with that. I think I need a little bit harder. Then what you need to do is just um, go to one leg. You can go to one leg at a time. It makes it quite a bit harder. So I'm going to go to my left leg and I'm going to raise this leg up. And then you just do the same thing. You just down, squeeze, down, squeeze, down, squeeze, just like that. You're squeezing your glutes, that's why I call it glute squeezes. And just go down and squeeze up, down and squeeze up. Make sure the angle of your knee isn't too, like this, and not too far this way either. You want it kind of, you'll get it, when you start doing it, you'll feel the, uh, the, a spot that feels best to do it. And you're just going to, you're not going to do 25 to 30 of these. I do maybe more like 15. You can go up to, so I would do three sets of 15. And then, of course, after you get that side done, you want to go to the other side, too. So I just put my right foot down where my left foot was so that I'm in a good spot. And then I raise up the other leg, and I just go down and squeeze. And I, these are a higher intensity, obviously, because you're just using one leg at a time. And um, I like one leg things because you can really see, um, like, my left leg. It was way harder on my left leg to do it. I am right-handed, but for some reason, it's just I'm more coordinated on my right side, so it's easier for me to do. And I'm going to do, I don't know how many that is, but keep going. I haven't done these in a while. I can really tell. It's working my glutes and my hamstrings. Whoo! There we go. And then I would do three sets of like 15 on each of the one-legged ones, or three sets um, of 20 to 20 to 30 of the two-legged ones. So um, again, that's one of my favorite glute exercises. Um, and I'll show you others in the future. I really like that one. It's a fun one, and I really can fill my glutes well for that one. So I hope you enjoy it, and um, you guys have a great day. See you in my next video. Bye.